Hello to you from Milan, a city synonymous with high fashion. The stadium might not be fashionable anymore, but it remains iconic, the San Siro. My name is Derek Ray. With me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England defender Lee Dixon. And we have pre-season group stage action from the European International Cup coming up for you. It is Norwich City and they face Swansea City. Yeah, first game of their pre-season. Time to dust off those cobwebs and start getting the fitness back, Derek. Wouldn't be surprised to see the manager give some of the young players a ride out too. There's definitely a few on the cusp of breaking into the first team. Roberts, Evans, not getting anxious when they have the ball, and he's through, and up for grabs off the keeper, Stieperman has it, Evans, and news of a goal in the Brescia match, Alan McAdally. It's a goal for the visitors. Nine minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. And teammates to play it to. And he just let his opponent fly by. Pulls it back. Clattered away. Mackay, playing with purpose and control, cleared away, now the pass not finding its target, and he cuts inside, he's got to score! And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. Well, as we look at this again, what they always say, focus on the ball, ensure you strike it cleanly. He's done just that. What a finish. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? The opening goal of the game then. And news coming through of a goal in the Neem game. Alan McAnally can tell us more. It's a goal for the home team. 19 minutes played, 1-1. Thanks very much as always, Alan. We're giving them the gift of possession. Andre Ayew. And he takes on the shot. Well, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. And that's a corner. And over comes the corner. And it's a goal. Level again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, it's almost the perfect headed goal. Brilliant delivery into the danger area. Good movement. Back of the net. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. I understand there's been a goal on the Kievo match. Alan McAnally can tell us more. It's a goal for Kievo. 24 minutes played. 1-1. One, one. Many thanks, Alan. Amadou. Temu Puki. Well, he was just a fraction offside then. That's all he needs to be, a fraction. And it was so close. And it's Connor Roberts. Lost it. And it's with Andre Ayew. Evans. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. 
He has been deemed to be offside, not by Muchley. Brilliant, brilliant officiating, that is. Look at that, spot on. Amadou. Well, he's lost it. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Wendia. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Bidwell. Here's Barry Mackay. Evans. And they'll have to throw it back in play. And let's go to Alan McAnally because there's been a goal I'm hearing in the spell match. Alan. It's a second goal for the home team. 39 minutes played. 2-1. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? And putting his body on the line. Hernandez. Fruitful looking attack. Good tackle. A chance maybe from the wide position. Still, and it's a quality pass. Safe pair of hands, did his job. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. It's Jamal Lewis. Well, he's lost the ball. And with that, the first half draws to a close. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Space and time for the cross. Well, the offside flag had to go up, and it did. Yeah, look along the line, look along the line. Aaron's Emiliano Buendia good use of the ball but can they trouble the defence Evans and slipped through beautifully Well, the keeper certainly didn't want to gamble with that, and a corner it'll be. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Now, can he deliver accurately? Couldn't keep it. Relentless high pressing. Untidy in possession. And fed forwards. It's still alive. And you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult. For... It's got to be! Well, he didn't have it quite on the target, Lee. No, it was a great opportunity. Sometimes you've got a choice, power or placement. He should have put his laces through it. Amadou. Emiliano Buendia. Aaron's Possession lost. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Grimes. Just hearing that a goal has gone in in the Granada game. Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Granada. It's been scored by Soldado. A well-placed curling effort from the corner of the box, striking the inside of the frame on its way in. 62 minutes played. 3-1. And offside is the decision. It must have been very closely. Well, yeah, the linesman's got the best view of them all. I think he got that right. And a substitution in the offing.
Well, Alan McAnally was in full flow. Unfortunately, we had to cut him off just moments ago. Just to confirm, Granada did score in that game. And their lead stands at 3 1. And on the ball, Tribul. Marco Stieperman. Buendia. And that was a very fine read. Bidwell. And news of a goal in the Kievo game. Alan McAnally with the details. It's a second goal for Kievo. 70 minutes played, 3-2. Many thanks, Alan. Fluency of movement. Well, his opponent, can he give them the lead? And up for grabs up, and he's dispatched the header! Well, here's the replay, the keeper's made a save, but it's not good enough, it's back into play. He was first to react, and it's in the back of the net. Well, 2-1 it is here. an important intervention and it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes Jake Bidwell Mackay oh he's given the ball away unnecessarily and a chance for him on the flank Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Here's Barry Mackay. Mackay. Selina. Here's Barry Mackay. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Well, visionary passing. Is it going to be? Well, that was a guilt-edged opportunity for the equaliser. Well, you always hope for one more chance in a game. And that was it. The chance for an equaliser. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Grimes. It's with Selina. Andre Ayu. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. It's opening up for them. Oh, maybe the equaliser. It's there for him. Well, it might still work out for them. A punch happy goalkeeper. As an attacking player, you rather hope you'll get the decision in your favour, but offside here. Yeah, the defence got that spot on, and so did the linesman. And there goes the final whistle.